Hi, this is Jeanette Carlson from the Bellevue Public Schools Technology Team, and today I'm going to show you how to embed a Padlet into your Schoology course. Go ahead and log into Schoology and navigate to the course where you would like to embed the Padlet. Click on Add Materials and scroll down to Add a Page. This is where you will embed your Padlet. Go ahead and title the page. Once you've titled the page, you're ready to go and grab your embed code from Padlet. Once you are logged into Padlet, go ahead and find the Padlet that you'd like to embed for your students and click on it. And over on the right hand side, you will see the share button. Click on the share button and then click on share, export, and embed. If you scroll down just a little bit, you will see embed in your blog or your website. If you click on that, you will see the embed code here and go ahead and click the pink copy button. Now you've copied your HTML embed code and now we're ready to put it into your Schoology course. So click back to Schoology and on the far right hand side you will see two circles and it will say switch to HTML. Go ahead and click on that and then paste your HTML code right in the box. And then at the bottom you have a few options to assign this um, individually to people or uh, publish to your students. And then the very last button is display on a new page. And that is the way we like to display our Padlets. And once I click create, I'll show you what that looks like. So click the create button. And then you'll notice down at the bottom, you'll see the Padlet example. So this is what the students would see, and they would go ahead and click on Padlet example. And in a new window, there would be the interactive Padlet. So as you can see, students can go ahead and scroll through the Padlet, reading what their classmates have shared. And to add to the Padlet, they would add just like they would if they were at the Padlet website. They just double click, go ahead and put their name, their title, and include the content that they want to share with their classmates. If you have younger students and you want your Padlet to display on the main page without having to click, go back to where you inserted your Padlet. So if you click on the gear next to your Padlet example and then click Edit, down at the bottom of the screen, if you hover over the icon that looks like a piece of paper, you see that right now it says display on a new page. So that's what it is doing. If you click on that and toggle, you will toggle to display in line. So now your Padlet will display in line and go ahead and click save changes. The Padlet then will show up right on your page, which might make it easier for younger students to access the Padlet without having to click. So that is how you embed a Padlet into your Schoology course. Thanks for watching.